is it possible to make a spacecraft that uses the plentiful hydrogen available in outer space? So that's a concept that has been uh, again discussed in uh, science fiction. It's called a Bussard ramjet. So in a Bussard ramjet, ramjet, you would have a spacecraft with a fusion engine. It fuses hydrogen and this fusion reaction impels it forward. And in front of the spacecraft, there is this enormous ram scoop, which is a scoop that's made up of enormous magnetic fields that go out into space for thousands of kilometers, maybe millions of kilometers. Now, we know that the interstellar medium is full of this very diffuse hydrogen gas. It's extremely diffuse. And this interstellar, interstellar medium is a better vacuum, a more perfect vacuum than anything we can have on the planet Earth. And yet it does have hydrogen atoms. It is a very low density of hydrogen atoms and perhaps even molecules in some places. So a Bussard ramjet, ramjet would exploit this property of the interstellar space. So the spacecraft would be propelled by a fusion reaction and it would have this enormous ram scoop in front of it, magnetic fields that extend for thousands or millions of kilometers. And these magnetic fields suck in all this diffuse hydrogen gas and they all, they bring it all into the, into the input of the, of the fusion engine, of the ramjet. And that's what serves as the fuel for this enormous... Uh, enormous ramjet engine. So yes, it is definitely uh, possible if you have the technological means to create such a, such a machine to use the interstellar hydrogen for fuel in, in, in a spacecraft. It is definitely possible. But of course, once again, we still are, we don't have anything close to that sort of technological ability as of today. Maybe a thousand years in the future, if we last that long then maybe we may be able to build such a such a spacecraft